everyone, it's Nona Grace and I'm from Western New York. Today is another nice and warm day and I was walking. I did I was going to do my walking steps today, but actually my fourth week which is tomorrow. So I will save my numbers for tomorrow and tell you and then I will have to do it again on the 31st only to give you the final for the week and for the month how many steps I got. The other two people that you can check on, they've done their walk for the for the week. And Simply Pam has done her fourth week. And go watch Pam. I will put the link in. And A Fruity Kind of Life, that's Heather. She's done her week three. These girls really did their video. I love the way they did their video. I, if I was more ambitious, I'd probably try to do it, but I'm not ambitious like they are. They actually are walking and talking as they're doing their videos, which is really nice. And Heather, I think you know, she did hers over a long, over the days, and she even says what day it is. I really enjoy watching her video, and I watch. I enjoy watching Pam. Pam is so darn cute. Our trips. We were just, we, in fact, we just canceled the trip that we were supposed to take in September because our gov governor has closed our state from traveling to almost all of the states. And what, a, what Jim did, he looked up to see what states we are not allowed to go to. And so I was sort of singing the song, Alabama and Alaska, Arizona, Arkansas. That's as far as I can go. And then I would know a little bits and pieces in between. And I go, oh, that one's not there. That one's not there. So there are a few that are not there, but I don't know the full song. I wish I did. Our governor has done a travel ban on 49 of the 50, or 41 of the 49 states because you can't include our own state in that. Yeah. We can travel in New York, but who wants to? In Pennsylvania. <laughs> and, and PA. Yeah, yeah, we used to shop in Pennsylvania because that was actually closer than going to the cities that are close to, our, in our state, they're farther away, so we never would go there. So I would like you to check out Simply Pam and A Fruity Kind of Life. They're both doing their walks. And they're doing 10,000 steps, where I'm only doing 5,000 steps. But then again, I'm the oldest one of the bunch. No, <laughs> although, not. although had had um, Heather met me when I was in my 30s, 40s, 50s, I would have given her a run for her money. <laughs> oh, yeah. I really would have. I would have. Uh, I was in a lot of walk challenges at work, and before 2:30, I would have my 10,000 steps. So I was really a go-getter. And if I was in a competition when I had the Fitbit, I used to, if somebody had like 20,000, I was going to get 21,000 or 22,000. I was going to get way more. Then my brother and my sister were getting like 90,000. I'm thinking, how the heck are they getting all these steps? Well, they were they were um, going for these great big, huge long walks. And, and one was putting the the Fitbit on her ankle and she was riding her bike so she was getting that exercise along with it so it was registering that so she was going a lot more they were both going a lot more than I was going so I figured eh, I can't keep up with them so I was still doing the, like the 20 and 25,000 steps and I thought I was doing really good till I saw their numbers okay I'm going to put a little video in and it was by a request of Marina yarning and darning she wanted to see the chicks so marina this is for you i'm going to put this little video in you're going to see that and then you're going to see you're going to see the incubator that i was trying to i'm trying to hatch an egg <laughs> this egg was abandoned and i feel bad that it was abandoned let's hope it's not a rooster because then it'll really be sad but um I'm going to try and hatch it. I don't know if it'll work or not. I have a makeshift incubator that I made a long time ago. And whether it works or not, I don't know. But this egg was sat on for quite a while. And then I put it under another hen, hoping that that hen would hatch it out. And then I thought, gee, if this hen hatches it out, she may abandon her eggs. So I decided I better, I better hatch that egg out if I can hatch it out. And if I don't, then I guess it's nothing lost because it was an abandoned egg. 
And then I'm going to show you too a little bit of Jim in the chicken area. He's putting a new ladder up for me. I mentioned today, just today I mentioned that I'd like a different ladder. And he he says, well, I guess I'll go out to the barn. And he built me a ladder. So it was like done like that. So let's go to the video and you can see. There's the new babies. There's the new babies with Blackie. Blackie's very nasty, so if she starts coming at me, I'm going to have to shut the door. But there's the three. She's got three. There's one over there. Oh, there's, there's two more. She's so, she's so mean. I just gave her some scratch. Okay. I was just outside walking and I thought, you know, maybe I'll share this with you. I don't know how it will turn out. But this one little egg, it's got the date 713 on it. One of the hens, let me think who it was. I think it was um, Silver. Silver had gotten another egg under her somehow. And when I noticed it, it was 713 and I don't know how long it was under her. So I marked it 713 and left it under her. But when her babies hatched, she got off the nest and left this egg. So I put this egg under one of the other broody hens. And then I thought, oh dear, if that egg hatches, they're gonna abandon their baby. So I decided maybe I better bring this egg in and see if I can hatch it in my makeshift incubator. Humidity is pretty low. I can't get it to go higher. 40 is as high as I can get it to go. And the temperature is like 100. So it's, and I've got the water source in there. But this is what I'm going to try to do. And then every now and then I turn it. It's supposed to hatch next week. So in about three days, I won't be able to turn it at all. Because they say the, the chick gets itself positioned for hatching. So I will not turn it after when it's close to three days to hatch. So we shall see. But this is what I'm using. This was, this was one of those um, containers that Emily's medicine used to come in. And so I uh, cut holes in it, made a window on both sides and a window on this side. This is this is glass. Well, it's plastic, but it looks like glass. And I put it in there. And then I had to put some straws for, see the straws? That was because it was getting too hot. So I made some vent holes. And I put a light in there. And that little bulb keeps the temperature up. So that's what I'm sharing with you. We'll, we'll let you know if it hatches or not. And if it doesn't, well, it was abandoned in the first place. I had Jim make a new ladder for the chickens because the babies will have it harder to come out. So he's he had to make me a different kind of ladder. If you need to take that little gate off, you can, you know, just for the moment nobody because none of the other hens will try to come in while you're out here we got poopies there I'll clean it up I don't know how well this is gonna work but it's a... well it looks good they'll be able to go up and down easy that looks good I think they're gonna like it they can, they can. Didn't really quite attach it the way I thought, but. Well, it'll stay as long as it stays. I didn't want it to fall. This, the other ladder was falling because when we, when we removed some of the stuff that we removed, it made it fall. But this, this looks good. I think they're gonna do great. Thank you so much. Those babies are gonna love you when they. Are you going to put a bracket under there to support it or something? Well, that was the intention, but, but this is not going to work the way I thought. Not the way you thought it would. Well, it, if it feels solid, I would just leave it there. Well, it's kind of... Kind of boingy. They're, they're not as heavy as your hand. I know they're not. <laughs> oh, dear. They're lighter. Do is I might not run the screw that way. Okay.
we're looking through the fence. Good control of that drill thing. I'd be going brr, brr, brr. <laughs> Very good. They won't be knocking that off. That's great. Okay, thank you so much. That'll be perfect. They're going to love it for it. And the new babies will be able to go up there real easy. And the new babies... They're still going to have to... Whoops, your head. You were just yeah, boned. They're going to have to... That's all right. They can hop. Section. They know how to do that. They can, they can hop onto this board. Mm -hmm. They probably could have done the other ladder, but I wanted this kind of ladder better. I think it's better for them. That one was, I think that's that was. That, that's what it was supposed to be. Supposed there. to be on. That's the one that the company gave us, but that's like really short. That'd be like crazy. Well, if this was setting on the ground like they intended it, not up a foot. Well, it I'm glad been it's. Right. I'm glad it's up. And there's the box that I put in here. Oh, somebody was in it. Hmm. They pushed the grass out a little bit. Hmm. Yep. I put that there because I've got. Two broody hens. There's Emma. Hello, Emma. Emma's not so nice when you're broody, but she's okay. And Dorothy. Dorothy is really nice when she's broody even. She doesn't even puff up and try to snap at you, but Emma will. And of course, I showed you. Oh, and there's my girl that doesn't like me very much. I can probably get your food and clean it out again. She keeps pushing the, let me put the camera down. She keeps pushing the, the wood chips in this. You could probably do. Huh? She pushes the door stuff. Okay. Oh, yeah, I'm sorry. I don't need to see what I was doing. My. Well, do you th what? What what you want? You almost always get. I do get. I always get what I ask for. That's why I have to watch what I ask for. <laughs> so that because if I if I'm really not sure that I really really truly want it, I better keep still because. If I mention it, he tries to get it for me or do it. If it's something he can build, it will be built. If it's something he needs to buy, well, he'll in, he'll he'll go on the computer and he will do a lot of research. So I have time to I have time to change my mind there. Yeah. What was I going to say now? Oh dear. I don't know, <laughs> I don't I'm know sorry. either. You just, <laughs> you just blew my mind. Um. Um, 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 that word, um, <laughs> we're thinking, 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 I'm thinking, I'm thinking, oh my goodness, I'm thinking. I maybe was going to say, oh, I know what I was going to say. I remembered, oh, here it comes back. I was going to ask you, do you think that egg will hatch? How many of you think that egg will hatch? You can put it in the comments below. The date on it is the 13th, so it only had like a couple weeks to go before it would have hatched. I did candle it, and all I see is an air bubble, so there must be something in there. I didn't see any movement or anything, but I did see an air bubble. That was the only thing. It's a brown egg, so it makes it hard to see through. So those of you that think it's going to hatch, just leave me a little comment and, and guess. I don't know if it will or won't. And if it's a girl or a boy, <laughs> no, we'll that'll see be. see how many are right. I know, and we'll wait to see. You have to wait for a while. Okay, that's my video for today. I hope you had a great night, and I'll talk to you all again tomorrow. Bye bye. Did I finish the story about the ticket?
about the ticket? I don't know. I don't think so. I don't think I did either. Maybe I should come back in. Hi again, <laughs> it's me. <laughs> I didn't think I'd leave. I, know. I didn't leave. So I hope you didn't leave after that little goodbye. I don't remember if I finished my story about our trip and the blue booger interfering. Well, we were supposed to go to Louisville, Kentucky on a motor vlog type trip. To a motor, motor vloggers rally. Okay, that's better. Motor vloggers rally. And I was going to get to meet Blue Bike and Doyle and possibly Jackie and... Possibly Geared Raven. Possibly Geared Raven, yes. I possibly could have met these people, but they canceled the Raleigh. Rally. 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 Yes. Rally is a person's name. <laughs> <laughs> Rally. Um, and so today Jim called the hotel, the one that we had before that we got three three, three rooms. rooms and we were only supposed to have one. And it was a non-refundable hotel. Oh boy, we were spitting bullets there for a little while, wondering whether they were going to give our money back. Well, they gave the money back on those rooms. And because we're banned from traveling, and because of the blue, and because bugger, of the blue booger, they're giving our money back. So we are all set. Now I'm done. <laughs> so is that it? Yeah. I think so, I yeah. I think so. Okay. <laughs> now we can go. And you can go too. I hope you stick around for that last little bit. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye.